Okay, so this is going to be the end of our sixth FTC, Frogan's Technology Conference. So what did we do today? Well, together we discovered how you can make your Frogan sites dynamic as of today. So it means that you can access Frogan's sites uh, hosted on distant servers. We also saw that very soon it's going to be possible to create Frogan's sites with authoring tools that will be available online that you can have on your computer because today we are releasing the FSDL software library and if you are a software developer, if you are a site developer, please send us your questions, your suggestions. You can always use the email address of the conference, ftcregistration at frogans.org, in order to send us your ideas, questions about the conference, etc., etc. For those of you in the room, or for those of you with us remotely, please send us emails and participate, like Esther, like Sebastian, like Jesse, like Olivier, like STG, who came here to demonstrate what they do with Frogan's technology. Share with us all your work. Come. Tell us about your offers as uh, FCR uh, technology accounts and tell us about your business ideas, your development ideas. Everyone needs to play a role in this Frogan's uh, development. Frogan sites, which three months ago were still kind of a potential, are becoming a reality. So what are the next steps of the project? some dynamic that needs to be added to the FSDL so that your Frogan site can recognize the users when they're connected. And to achieve that, you, and you can manage sessions, you can enter passwords and many other things. You'll have new platforms that will be available soon for the Frogan's player more Linux distribution and availability, mobile platforms arriving pretty soon, more computer programming languages managed by the FSDL uh, libraries, software library, thanks to an increased number of wrappers so that they can be used with all your professional tools. And a next conference that will be organized in three, four months' time, I think, will be meeting in June. And, of course, the next step in the Frogan's project is the resolution of Frogan's addresses and having Frogan's site on the Internet network without any restriction or any setting whatsoever. So that's the end of the test star, it's the beginning of Frogan star, golf star, and so many others. So, yes, there must be some stars. I don't know if anybody reserved that name. Well, anyway, all what's left is for me to tell you to create Frogan's site to be in touch with us or be in touch with Joe via his blog or to be in touch with uh, Esther, Jinkit. They are members of the Frogan's project. And please be connected. Look at the Twitter. Look at your Twitter accounts to be informed and please don't miss our next conference. Good evening. <laughs>